Danny, why'd you do that? I hate that fucking song. But that was our band. Yeah, I know. It still sucks. I miss our old band. Fuck that shit. What about our fans? They're dying for us to get back together. Fuck those people. All they ever wanted was a piece of me. I gave them a piece every once in a while. What's so bad about that? <sighs> if only it were that simple, Susie. Well, come on in. Thanks for seeing me, Jenny. I came as fast as I could. What the hell are you talking about, Sal? I got the memo from the office saying you needed to see me about something. Yeah, right. Sure, Sal. I needed someone to come over right away to do all my slang for me. I thought of you first thing. Gee, Jenny. Break my balls, why don't you? Like you have any. Speaking of balls, I see you have a new neighbor, Jenny. Yeah, he's some dude named Dick Pissed. I met him earlier. Remember he used to be in that shitty 80s band, Les Surgic Jerks? No shit? No shit. Did you get his number? Hey, Sal. I heard someone dropped some slank on the bathroom floor. Why don't you go see if you can lick it up? Yeah, right. No, wait, really? Seriously? Somebody spilled some on the floor? Yeah, totally. Right by the toilet. Go check it out. Nah, that's okay. I was just kidding. Say, I'm gonna go see if Ivan is around. Yeah. <laughs> so did you get his number? Yeah, I got his number all right. Don't you remember who he is? He's that guy who had all those seed to weed in one week commercials back when they first made weed legal. Oh yeah, right. I remember now. That guy was a trip. Yeah, he kind of is. I just hope he's cool. I remember his band had a cool drummer, Count Jerkula. Yeah, I remember that guy. He used to get kicked off MTV shows all the time. Those guys had cool videos back in the 80s. Tell you what, Susie. I'll go over and ask Jerkula and DP to join us. How's that sound? Really? Are you sure? Yeah, why not? I'll be right back. Check it out! He started off the floor! Hey, Dick! Dick pissed! Are you home? Yeah, hang on a second. All right, but hurry up. Wow, crack the whip. Well, I don't have time to wait around. Hey, nobody waits for me. Well, that's cool. Hey, we're having a little get-together over at my place. You guys want to come? Yeah, party. We're there, dude. You guys got any weed? Fuck yeah, we got enough for an overdose. I never heard anyone overdose on weed. Well, I can give it a try. Hey, Jerkula, go get us some. Cool, I'll be right back. Don't leave without me. I'll get you back with some slank later. Slank? What the hell is that? You'll love it. It's local. Really local. It's like coke without all the side effects. Never heard of it. No one has. Hey, my car is too small for all of us. Let's take my van then. It sits about 20. So how long have you been here, Jenny? I've been here a couple of years. I got a great deal in my house, but there's a few drawbacks about this place. Yeah, like the fact that living in Vapor Valley is like living on the moon. There ain't shit going on around here. I'm so bored I think I'm seeing ghosts. I've got a great deal in my place too. I don't know why. There's nothing wrong with it. Well, not on the inside at least. Look, I gotta tell you. Before we get back to my place, you need to know something. What, are you married? Married? No. But get this. There's something up with this place, Vapor Valley. Right after I moved here, I found a... a portal in my house. A portal? Yeah. I got sucked into this portal. 
I found a group of people who all took a super powerful drug back in the 60s that tripped them out so hard that they like lost their minds or bodies actually. Now they're kind of trapped here, kind of like ghosts. They call themselves vapors. What? You're kidding me, right? We're almost there. You'll see for yourself. Are there any hot vapor chicks? Hey Susie, I'm back. This is DP and Dracula. They just moved to town. Wow, hi guys. I really dug your band. What band? Thanks, Susie. I dug your band too. What band? Let me give you a tour of the place, DP. Yeah. Hey, maybe you can show me where the slank is. Control yourself while I'm gone, Dracula. So this is the portal I was telling you about. All the vapors live in there. Huxley is the guy who makes all the slank. Well, that's fucking weird. Yeah, I know. But everything is weird around this place. Well, let's get weird. What the fuck just happened? We just went through the portal. Now we're in the vapor dimension. Huxley and the rest of them live in here. He's always looking for the right formula to fix them all, but so far has only made more slank, which is probably a good thing. Why is that? Because he gives it out for free. Free? Yeah, as long as you're cool. You better be cool, DP. Yeah, I'm the coolest guy I know. What about Jerkula? Hey, I'm the coolest guy he knows too. If your band is any indication of how cool you guys are, I should be worried. Hey, Synthesizer Girl was top 10. Top 10 one-hit wonders, maybe. Yeah, I wish. Hey, Huxley. This is our new neighbor, Dick Pissed. Whoa. Hey, how you doing, man? Glad to meet you, man. DP used to be in a big band back in the 80s. Then I got into the weed business. Weed, huh? I used to smoke a little week, man. You like weed? I can supply you with all you want. Right on, man. I'll tell you what. Maybe we can make a trade, man. You like slank? Never tried slank. What's it like? Here, try some. <sighs> Fuck yeah! Now that's what I'm talking about! You like it? I love it! Well, sounds like a deal then. Doing drugs, hey! Right? I ordered a pizza while you guys were gone! What kind? So you're doing drugs. Oh shit! I forgot to ask! So, what'd you think of the place, DP? I don't know what to think after doing that slank. Slank? But I just ran into this fucking guy who gave me this long song and dance about wanting to be my new manager. He almost had me ready to agree until I realized he was even higher on slank than I was. That's just Sal. He thinks he's my old manager. Just ignore that guy. Then he took off to the bathroom with his giant walking eyeball. That's Ivan. He's a blind neighbor who did so much slank that he turned into a giant eye. Wow, nice crowd you got here. The only crowd in Vapor Valley. I got a pizza for Count Jerk Me Off or something. Yeah, that's me. I guess. That'll be 20 bucks. Hey, DP, you got 20 bucks? 
you. Hey, you take weed instead. Fuck yeah, I do. Thanks, man. And remember, it's Count Jerkula. Whatever, jerk off, you love. So I was wondering, why do you call yourself Count Jerkula? Because Count Dracula was already taken. Doing, and because he's a jerk. Just for that, I'm not going to give you any of my pizza. Only you would bring a pizza to a slank party, Jerkula. <laughs> Hey Sal, you better cool it. You're starting to freak out some of my friends. Your friends are freaks. Look at them. How much like these guys been doing? You got me? Hey Sal, what's your deal? You want a deal? Sign my label, man. We'll make you a star again. I wouldn't lie, man. Clunk has a bunch of great artists. Crack toe and Flugie, Saiyan Frog, Deadbeats. Oh, you just got London LaDouche. He just got a new brand new house. He got an apartment in Shit City. Go away, Sal. We don't want me. London LaDouche can suck it. Alright, alright. But hey, seriously. You got any slank? Yeah, but I accidentally spilled it on the bathroom floor. Crapto and Flugie? Seriously? You know what? They just got a new contract. Hey, be right back. I gotta take a piss. Why do you put up with that guy? Don't wear I don't know. Pants he's harmless. You are gonna get I guess he's fun to kick around. I know a guy like that myself. Who, Jerkula? I thought he was the drummer in your band. What band? Hey man, can you play some Def Leppard? How about some White Snake? Hey, what's with that DJ? Is he an octopus? That's DJ 8-Ball. He's a total slankhead. All these guys who look weird are just slankheads who did too much. Now they're like permanently screwed up. He won't play the songs I requested. Don't feel bad. He's an octopus. He doesn't understand what anyone is saying. Well, that's weird shit. I know. But there's even weirder shit going on here in Vapor Valley. Another lonely night for us here at the Rave Yard, Lloyd. It's been real dead here lately, Floyd. It's because everyone is on Slank now. They think we're beneath them. I hate that Slank. What's wrong with a good old-fashioned drinking? Nothing wrong with it, Lloyd. In fact, I think I'll have another old-fashioned drink. No, Osaki. We haven't come across anything. And quit trying to be a ghost. We can see you ain't no ghost. I seem to have lost a part of myself. Did you check the lint trap? We seem to be running low on the hard stuff, Lloyd. Maybe we can get more over at Janie's. Oh wait, she's probably still pissed off at us. Well, maybe you shouldn't steal all their hard stuff and leave ghostly goo over the bathroom floor. That wasn't me. I took all their alcohol, yeah, but it was Saki that left the mess. I was looking for my maid. We all know it wasn't Saki who broke the dishes, cracked the mirrors, and drove Morgana into a tizzy. Yeah, that was you. Well, I say we give it another go. Who's with me? Well, I'm sure it's livelier than this place. Come on, Saki. I'll stay here. If you see another Saki, I mean ghost who looks like me. Let me know, okay? Why don't you go check the trash in the laundromat? Not you two. Go away, you guys. 
Hello, Jenny. How are you this evening? Cut the crap, Floyd. I'm still mad about the last stunt you idiots pulled. It weren't us that caused all the problems last time. It was Sal and Saki. We behaved ourselves, Miss Jenny. And look, we brought a peace offering to show there's no hard feelings. Schnapps? Seriously? Look, I'll give you one more chance. You can hang out with Sal and those guys in the backyard. That's very kind of you, Jennifer. My name's Jenny. You better behave yourselves this time. I don't want to see a bunch of bottles and crap laying around. Thank you, Jenny. We promise. We are nothing but the cleanest drunken ghosts around. Then try washing your dirty socks once in a while. That's not our sock, Jenny. That's Jimmy Hendrix's old sock. He said he became alive when he used him to strain the original batch of slank he made back in the 60s. Yeah, I've heard all this before. Now he spends his time looking for his long-lost mate and pretending he's a ghost. Because I guess he idolizes you idiots or something. He wishes he were a ghost. I wish you'd get lost. Slank? Why do I keep hearing that? I hate that Slank. Is there anything you don't hate, Lloyd? Uh, hmm. So this is what it's like being dead? Lame. This is what it's like being dead drunk. Hey, you used to be in the Lysergic Jerks. What happened to you guys? Well, things were going good, but our bass player was 111 years old, and he died suddenly. Well, man, he was 111 years old. He died in a knife fight. Then DP decided to retire. I guess now we just grow weed. Don't you miss the big time? I miss the chicks, I know that. I don't know how big time we were. You guys were all over the place, just like Jenny's band. We had one hit song, Synthesizer Girl. You remember? Yeah, Synthesizer Girl and her supersonic swirl. Yeah, that's the one. Don't sing that around DP or he'll flip. So I shouldn't ask him about reforming the band. Not if you... Wait. Sure, go ahead. Why'd you say it like that? Like what? I need to find some more slang. I'm sick of continually being ordered to the backyard. Yeah, they sent me out here because I guess I was bothering the DJ too much. I hate that DJ. But alas, it's either out here or the Raveyard. Raveyard? What's that? I never heard of it. A club, I guess you could say. But lately it has become rather dead. What? A club out here in Vapor Valley? Yes, a club. Special invite only. If you're not already a member of the cemetery. What's this club inside? A tomb? Well, yes. But it's a lovely tomb. A mausoleum, actually. You're kidding. Come on! Let's take the cake back there. Here we go again. I don't know. I don't know where he is. I don't know where I am. I don't know. I don't know. Hello, Spaz. Have you heard anything about my lost mate? I've worn myself out looking for him. I'm not even sure what he looks like, or who he is, or what I am. I have a huge hole in me, and I'm desperately trying to find him. Have you seen him? Please, can you help me? I'm looking for... You're looking for a lost sock. We know. Try looking in the laundry pile. Sometimes I wonder whatever happened to Octavia. Me too. I wonder if she's still playing the drums. I wonder if she's still doing drugs. Probably not as much. 
Why not? She always had the best drugs. Yeah, but she always got them from me. Oh, yeah. Hey, I had a feeling you two were up to no good. Well, I had a feeling someone was watching us. Where's Jerkula? Some place called the Raveyard? Oh, he must be with Floyd and Lloyd, the ghosts. Yeah, I thought I saw a ghost. Those guys are no good. You should warn Jerkula to stay away from those deadbeats. Well, if they're deadbeats, then the Jerkula's kind of crowd. I can't believe they kicked me out of the house again. I thought you said you were Jenny's manager. Sal ain't her manager. He wishes he was. Last we heard, the only acts you managed were Crap Toe and Floogie, Screaming Frog, and Lyndon LaDouche. Singing Frog. And Lyndon LaDouche is making a huge comeback. Lyndon LaDouche? Seriously? He'll be bigger than the Beatles. But first, want to do some slank? No, I don't want to do some slank. I'd rather snort laundry detergent. Laundry? Did I check the laundry? Someone say rave party round here somewhere. Who told you that shit again? Wandering Sock. Wandering Sock don't know anything. Wandering Sock don't know who Wandering Sock is. Rave somewhere round here. We never find rave party now. Wandering socks saved by that Annette Funicello place. Oh yeah, I know place. Who are all these people? I don't know, I think they're all Sal's friends. They just keep showing up. They do all our slang. It doesn't matter if we kick them out, they always manage to reappear. Sal seems like a great guy. Hey DP, can you really grow weed in a week? Well, uh, maybe a couple of weeks. What about, it grows before your very eyes? What does, the money you made? <laughs> <laughs> Come see for yourselves back at my place. Back at my place, man. What about it? What about what? Man, you need to do some more slank. Hey, don't hold out on us. Anyway, you don't have a place, David. None of us are going to have a place if we've got to keep doing this shit to stay alive. I'll do yours if you want to quit, Huxley. Well, thanks a lot, Huxley, for screwing us up. Yeah, thanks, Huxley. Don't worry, girls. I'll find a cure soon. Yes, sure. Nothing's ever going to be the same. Hey, that gives me an idea. Hey guys, I think I found a solution. Really? For what? I've realized that we need to recreate the exact same conditions as when I made the first slank. But wasn't there a huge festival going on? And, um, Jimi Hendrix? Oh yeah, that could be a problem. Wait, you don't need Jimi Hendrix. I see his sock wandering around all the time. Great, so all we need now are 10,000 people. Hey, I think this is the place wandering sock talking about. No shit, there's the place. Now we're party. Don't know. No party signs around here. Hey, what about over there? Where? Over there, idiot. Looks like rave party over there. That could be a place. Of course it plays. Can't you hear music? 
over the head but screaming. So then I hocked my keyboard for a bus ticket to shit city. Man, I wouldn't hock my drums for anything less than two tickets. Why would you need two tickets? Because this place is so boring, I'd want to leave it twice. If it's so boring, why do you stay here? Someone's got to bring some life to this party. Oh, well, thanks for blessing us with your presence, Jerkula. Hey, no problem. Life is just an endless cycle. Spinning around and around. I feel so unraveled and torn, looking for my lost soulmate. They keep saying to check the laundry basket. Which basket? I've checked them all. I've looked in every closet. Did I check Jenny's closet? Hey, have you seen the ghosts? Are they for real? <laughs> yeah, I see them all the time. I think they're for real. What about the vapors? Are they just ghosts too? No, they're still like alive, but they're in vapor form and have been ever since the hippie days. They need to do slank all the time of them just like disappear. The ghosts, Floyd and Lloyd, have been around for just as long, I guess. I'm not sure if they're somehow related. Related? I mean, if they're all here because of the same reason. I wonder why I'm here sometimes. To do my dirty work. I know why I'm here. Why? To party. That seems like a noble cause. We should go get some more weed for our noble cause. Let's go. Where's all the slank? There's plenty around, Sal. Just ask anyone around here. No one seems to want to talk to me. They just roll their eyes. What did you expect, Sal? You're always hassling everyone for it. I thought that maybe I could offer my services for some in return. I just signed Suicide Spider. I can make things happen. Sal, has anyone ever told you you're delusional? I heard Suicide Spider just broke up. I think their lead singer killed himself with cyanide. Oh, uh, <laughs> I, uh, haven't gotten that call yet. Anyway, we should get ready to get going to DP soon. Sure, okay. Hey, Jenny, wait. I have some information here somewhere. Oh, no! That's quite the clutter you have there. Is this what you are so excited about? Sal, if there's anything you need, I think it's sleep. DP? This is nothing. Wait till you see my room. What are you, like, 12? You might as well be. Hey, Jenny, have you seen my room? We don't want to see anyone's rooms. We just want to get some weed, man. Well, I don't know. What's your room like, Jerkula? It's cool. I got my drum set up there. Unfortunately. Maybe we can trade some weed for slank? Yeah, that's cool. No way! I'm not trading my good ganja for some bogus crap called Slank. Well, you can keep your bud then. I'll do whatever I want with mine. You don't do Slank, Jerkula? No way! I don't do stuff like that. That's cool. Either do I. Yeah, the badass Count Jerkula can't even handle his drugs. I don't do drugs. I am drugs. Protect the laundry basket.
she won't mind if I look. There it is! At last! I don't want to go in now because they'll want to follow us. Who the hell are they? They're the roller skating zombies. They're always looking for a rave party. A rave? I guess so. They're always looking for a non-existent party. I had them over once, but they messed the place up, get mud everywhere, and gross people out. Hey, zombies! Is rave party here? No. The rave party's over by the cemetery. You sure about that? That's right. The rave party is over by the cemetery. See you there. Just gotta grab my coat. Okay. We'll see you over by cemetery. Seems like rave party was going on here. Guess not. Nothing like it seems anymore. Let's get inside before those idiots come back. What's taking so long? Can't you do anything right? I need a drink. It won't budge. I need a drink too. Let's go get us a drink. We'll have all the drinks we need once you get that lid off. Why don't you help me then? You know how my legs got shot off in the war and all and I just... Uh huh. Uh. Oh no, we've been spotted. What? Who? Where? Woo! Go away! Go away or I'll steal your soul! Woo! We're going to haunt you! Woo! Give me break! We'll haunt you! Well, I'll eat your brains! Brains! I ain't got no brain to... I mean, woo! I'm a ghost! Woo! Go away! We'll put the curse of the ghost on you! Oh no! Curse of ghost! I hope we don't get curse of ghost! That's right, curse. We don't care about curse. We don't care about ghost. We only here look for rave party. Said somewhere around graveyard. Wait, I've heard of you two. I thought you were spooky ghost. We are spooky ghosts. Remember Lloyd? You dumbest ghosts I ever saw. I tell you, the answer lies within this tomb. I don't know. I checked darn near all them, Floyd. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. See, there was a time, a long time ago. Not too long ago, but a long time ago. Back in the beginning, Floyd? Yes, the beginning of time. Groovy man. Using Jimmy's sock as a filter, I made a five gallon bucket of liquid slink. Enough to get the world high. But it takes a little while for the liquid to crystallize. So far, I've dried about two ounces. 2,000 more to go. Oh fuck man, it's the pigs. We gotta get out of here. Yeah man, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh shit, I gotta stash this stuff. 
Oh, I never got a chance to try it. Fuck, I wonder what they want. Well, they won't even give this a second look. Bummer, man. This is the only place I can stash this for now. I can cross my fingers. Come on, baby. We gotta get out of here for a while. I wonder what's going on. It's just the pigs hassling us for no reason. Hope Charlie and Vera don't get busted. For what? For being young. That's reason enough. Well, fuck. I wonder if the pigs have split yet. Maybe. Who knows? What was Huxley doing? I thought I saw Jimi Hendrix in there with him. Yeah, it was Jimi. I guess they're synthesizing some kind of new acid or something. I don't know. New kind of acid? Have you done any? No. Huxley was just talking about it. It's supposed to be ready tonight, in time for the festival. Hmm. Maybe we should try some when it's ready. Maybe. Maybe we should see if the cops are gone yet. How do you do? Yeah, that's all ancient history, Floyd. But what's it got to do with what we're looking for? It doesn't. I just thought I'd bring you up to speed on how we got here, Lloyd. Uh, you like to go on about the past, don't you, Floyd? There is no past without the present, and there is no present without the future. There ain't no future of being a ghost, that's for sure. Not much of a present either, Lloyd. Push that lid off. Hey, Floyd, I think I found something. Yes, let me see. At last, my ruby chalice. What? Pour me a drink, my good man. You what? Cheers, here's the better times. You mean to tell me that I've been breaking my back all over this here graveyard for the past 20 years so you could find your old cup? Not my cup, my ruby chalice. Well, la ti freaking da What good is that thing supposed to do anyway? It makes me look stylish, and it holds my drink. Well, it made me look like a darn fool. Well, it wasn't the cup that made you look like a fool, Lloyd. I need a drink. So those ghosts have this weird club called the Graveyard. It's okay, I guess. I'm kinda dead. Susie and I went there once when I first moved here, but the thought of all those dead bodies around here freaked us out. Yeah, I'm not hanging out in some old mausoleum. Converted into a club or not. I'm getting tired of all the spooky shit going on in this fucking area. In fact, I'm about ready to smash some spooky ass if this trip does end soon. Speaking of spooky, there's Morgana. She's all fucked up. I'm gonna ask her to give me a reading. Darling, I see a hazy vision of you struggling to move a large object. With another large thing behind you. You mean like my car? It's always breaking down. It doesn't seem to be your car. Smaller than that. The vision has ended. Well, that's a sucky fortune. I'm going to be stuck between a rock and a hard place. Great. Good thing we always got some more good old slank. Good thing? I don't know what I'd ever do without it. 
Wow, that was a real header to the dome. You all right? Yeah. Hey, I gotta go check the mail. At two in the morning? Yeah, that's when they deliver it. Hey Jenny, did you get any mail? Mail? Yeah, you were out to get the mail, remember? We were starting to think the zombies got you or something. Why would I go get mail at 2 in the morning? You got me. You must be expecting an important Bed Bath & Beyond coupon or something. Those things are great. They never expire. You never seem to expire, Sal. I think those ghosts full of shit. I think they real ghosts. No, dumbass. I think they knew where Rave Party was. Rave. <laughs> Damn jungle kids. I'll eat your brains! Jungle kids! Jungle kids! Time to die! Little bastards always get away! Someday we get those jungle kids! They too fast! They well organized! I'll catch them on my skates! You better off without them! Why? Cause you sucky skater, that's why. Well, I don't know where they come from. That's right. I see Johnny going over there through the graveyard. That place has been empty since the 60s. I have no idea where my son would be going there. He won't tell me anything. Yeah, 20 years now. I know. I can't believe he's been gone that long. It seems like just yesterday that he left on the way to the festival. Well, that's the weird part. I swear some of those people I saw were from those times. Like they were the spirits of those who disappeared that day. Including my husband. Come on, man. Let me have a little more. 
I need it, man. It makes the music groove. I don't know, man. I've seen this shit wreck some people. I can handle it, man. It's not like I'm gonna turn into a monster by doing a few lines. That's not guaranteed. Here, man. I got some weed. Alright, man. I guess a little more won't hurt you. But let me warn you, this is the last of the most potent slank I've ever made. Be careful. Right on, man. It's time to let the music take over. Isn't this the finest chalice you've ever seen, Lloyd? Meh, it's not so great. I was awarded this as a special grand prize, Lloyd. For what? Pushing ghosts around and making them do your dirty work? Where's all them drinks we were supposed to have once I found what you were looking for? Aside from that, Lloyd, I was going to tell you how I won this marvelous cup. Okay, Floyd, how'd you win your precious cup then? Well, you see, a long time ago, a lifetime ago actually, we would sometimes hold a match, if you will, to see who could imbibe the largest quantity of hard stuff before succumbing. You mean you had a drinking contest? Commoners might call it that, yes, but we had much more class. How much class did you have when you drank yourself to death? It was during that contest that I did die, Lloyd, and that chalice was awarded to me posthumously. I thought the winner was the last man conscious. It was. Then I dropped dead. But I won, and now I have my just reward. Well, that's really nice, Floyd. I'm real happy for you. Thank you, Lloyd. I'm glad you understand. Bullshit! I want a fancy cup, too! And I want fancy drink and fancy women! Well, maybe someday you can meet a nice girl. Fuck that! No girls like me, I'm a ghost! I freaked them out! Maybe if... Maybe if you check the laundry, they said. What's that, Saki? Check the laundry. Check the laundry basket. I did. I did check the laundry basket. Well, what'd you find? Dirty clothes. Fuck, I don't know, DP. What? I wouldn't mind reforming for this one time, but I don't know where our drummer Octavia is. Yeah, I was wondering. Last I heard, she was living in a laundromat in Shit City. No shit? Yeah. Susie tried looking her up a few times, but Octavia just wants money and drugs. She never changed. I really don't want her even knowing where I live. I don't think anyone knows you live out here. You'd be surprised. I already saw something about us on TV earlier. There are cameras everywhere, I swear. What, you and me? Yeah. We've already had a baby that we sold to the UFOs. Ha! <laughs> I wonder what a UFO would pay for a baby. seeing those guys synthesizer girl and her supersonic swirl I think I saw them in Ireland I used to like synthesizer girl I think here we were reforming the band. Don't get your panties twisted. It's not certain. Well, what's the holdup? My drummer. I can't have her back. You know, I think Jerkula can play the drums a little bit. Yeah, I play for Lysergic Jerks. Well, now you play for Lysergic Zilch. Cool, a super group. Oh man, I feel sick. Hey Jerkula, this is a one-time show. Don't get your hopes up. I gotta get my drums! So, 
Tell us what's new. Not much. I'm just looking for Dracula. Have you seen him? No, I haven't seen him. How can you see anything with that darn cut blocking review? Do you like my Ruby Chalice, Sal? You won that down at the Dead Man's Club, didn't you? Yes, how did you know? My reputation precedes me. Because I have one too. All I had to do was out drink all the rummies down there. Ha! I knew it! Lies! This is a special grand prize. It says Made in China on the bottom. Ha 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 ha! Oh! Ha ha! I was just kidding. You didn't win a cup? No, I won the cup. I just wanted to see if Ford was dumb enough to spill his drink. Hey, to make it up to you, let me buy you a drink over at Jenny's. They don't like us much over there. They don't like me much over there. But that don't stop me. We don't want to be bothersome. Look, are you two coming or not? We got a long walk, and the jungle kids are back again. I hate those jungle kids. We'll be okay if we hurry. I think I've been doing too much slang lately. Probably. Yeah, maybe I should lay off that shit. Seems kind of dangerous. Yeah, but it gets you high. Look what it did to those vapors. I'm not sure what to think of them. It's all new to me too. Yeah, the whole thing seems really weird. I feel like we're all part of some big... I don't even know. That's how I've been feeling lately. I feel really weird. I think I've begun to flake out here in Vapor Valley. I don't think it's you. I think it's something in the water around here or something. Yuck. I don't drink water. Well, it must be something in the air then, because this place doesn't make any sense. Well, let's get high about it. More slank? No, I want to smoke some weed. Okay, let's head back to my place for a bit. I gotta check things and I'll get us some more. Cool. Fuck, that's some good weed. What kind is it? I call it dick weed weed. Well, that's clever. What the fuck? <laughs> Who the hell are those brats? I think they're called the Jungle Kids. That's the first time I've ever seen them. What's their deal? I guess they like to throw bottles and smash things. Or I wonder where their parents are. I don't think they have any. So are you serious about doing this festival? Sure, why not? Even if those vapor people can't fix their problem, we can still have a good time. I know Jerkula is looking forward to it. He's been practicing since he found out. Speaking of practice, I'm out of it. Completely. Hey, so am I. But we can work on it together. Let me grab some of this weed so we can get out of here. Cool. Let's head back to my place so we can start making a plan. Hey, is that you, DP? Yeah, it's us. We're heading back to Jenny's. Take me with you! We better hurry before someone sees you two. What's wrong with us? Everything. Get you jungle kids! What the hell? Jungle kids! I hate them damn jungle kids! Let's go get those kids! You two go right ahead. We're right behind you. Let's get the Jennies before they figure out we're gone. I'm getting too old for this. I see that? Yeah, it's those damn kids again. They were attacking Sal and the zombies, ha! Huh? Hey, let me out! Why? 
I'm gonna get those little brats. I'll catch you guys later. Good luck with all of that. And he chased after them? Yeah, I took off in a flash. I wonder what he'll do if he catches them. Probably suck their blood. I hope not. Probably ask them if they ever heard of him. I've never even heard of him. Hey, what happened with those jungle kids? I don't know. We got out of there. We bravely ran away. We made a hasty retreat. What are you three cowards afraid of? A bunch of kids? Jungle kids! I hate those jungle kids. We need to make this music festival happen. No way, Sal. You're not included. What? What do you mean? I'm your manager. You guys need me. To do what? All of our slink? You can fuck off, Sal. You and all your crummy buddies. Hey! What? Well, you don't have to be mean. Yeah, DP. Sal's just trying to help. Help himself to whatever he can take. Look, I know Sal is a mess, but maybe we should give him a chance. Fuck it. If I'm gonna be dumb enough to stage a reunion show, might as well be dumb enough to let Sal manage me. Again? The first time. Whatever. That's cool with me. Awesome. Cool. Wow. Okay. Off to a great start. I wonder where Jerkula is. I don't know. He should have been back by now. Let's go find him. Down the street? Yeah, let's walk down there and see what kind of trouble he's into now. Sure, let's go. It's somewhere around here, by all these broken bottles. Careful. There's shit everywhere around here. Oh, <laughs> That sounds like the zombies. Through that tunnel. I think they all went in here. Do you want to go in? Yeah, let's go. So, could you pour some of that beer into my golden chalice winner's cup? You mean that thing? Yes, do you mind? I mind you blabbing on about that damn thing I found. I'm sorry, Lloyd. I didn't think you realized that you didn't have a cup of your own. That's easy enough to remedy. A drinking contest at the Dead Man's Club? Easier than that, even. Here you go, Lloyd. That's for finding my chalice. What good is this? It's empty! Some people are never happy. Hey, where is everyone? I don't know, but while the cat's away, the mice will play. Let's make our way to the bar. I'm sure they won't mind. I'm sure they won't mind if I find their stash of slate while they're gone either. You dirty drug addict. You filthy drunk. Let's just agree that we're filthy dirty mice. Agreed. Agreed. Look, over there by that big rock. Wow, there's something in the air here. Yeah, some kind of vapor. It's fucking with my head. We gotta get out of here. But where did everyone go? I'm not sure. They were just here. Slink isn't real. What's that? I'm not sure if I'm real, yeah? We gotta get out of here. Wait. What the fuck is this? What does it matter? None of this is real. Shape up, DP. I think the kids went down into this hole. I quit the jerks because I knew I couldn't come with another hit. What? What are you going on about? If they find me, I'm fucked. Who? I think Vapor Valley is a mirage. Look, I know you're tripping out, and I know this place is fucked up. And I know how it feels to be pressured and used and spit out. But I also know we need to get out of here before we pass out. We're gonna pass out because we're all robots. 
What the fuck is wrong with you? Where did they go? How we get back here? We're rave party. No, wait a minute. We almost had those kids. What kids? Kids a rave, rave party around here somewhere. What the fuck are you talking about? Rave. Screw this. I'm out of here. But we couldn't find them. What do you mean we? Those stupid fucking rave zombies followed me into the woods when I was trying to catch those jungle kids. I hate those jungle kids. Yeah, I kept hearing Jen and DP, but I never saw them. We stay away from those woods. Anyone who goes in there never comes out. Well, I came out. Yeah, but what about Jen and DP? This. I'm gonna go talk to Huxley and see if he knows what's going on. I'll go with you! The children love to laugh and play While they throw their things away While they play the fog will creep in the forest heart so deep, vapor arising from the pit, move the stone that covered it. Jerkula, is that you? I think so. Are you dick pissed? Yeah, I think so. Then I'm Count Dracula. I'm sure. What the hell's going on, man? Fuck, man, I don't know. Everything is getting weird. I think I saw Jimi Hendrix in that tunnel. Did you get his autograph? How many socks did he have on? What? It looks like this big rock is supposed to cover this hole. But there's still a tunnel to the house. Is that where you came from? Yeah, from the vapor room. Oh, now I get it. What? Whatever this vapor is that's coming from this hole is what's causing all the weird shit. It's like some kind of gas. No shit? Yeah, we need to, like, seal this fucker off. Let's try to push this rock onto it. But the tunnel... Fuck the tunnel. Let's jam this fucker in there. Well, that's done. That seems to have worked. I think the air is clearing out. Yeah, I can breathe easier now for sure. I wonder what that shit was. What the hell could have caused that? Natural gas? Maybe that's why this place is called Vapor Valley. I always wondered why. I don't think it was natural gas. More like unnatural gas. Well, why did it lead to my house? Oh man, if we plugged it up here, it must really be coming out over there. Well, let's go plug that up, too. Where did that tunnel lead to, Jerkula? There's a hole in the wall behind a tapestry down in the bedroom in the portal room area. How did you find it? It was just there, open, like something tore through it, I guess. Well, let's go board that sucker up. This all seems familiar, but I'm not sure where I am. Where am I? Who am I? I feel so all alone. Look, another laundry basket. 
Have I checked there before? I'm looking for my mate. At last! At last I found him! My mate! Lloyd, where's everyone gone to? You seem to be all alone anymore. Even that darn sock seems to have disappeared. I don't know, Floyd. I haven't seen anyone lately but you and your ruby chalice. I mean, I know this place is dead, but now it's completely deceased. Remember how it used to be, Floyd? No, I can't quite recall. It seems we used to go to a house with people in it. Yeah. What was that girl's name again? Jan? Jenny? Yes, Jenny. But it all seems like a long time ago. But it couldn't have been that long ago. Same song still playing on stereo. What music, Lloyd? I thought music was playing. Maybe not. Let's go outside, Lloyd. See if we can find anyone. Who are we looking for? I don't know. I'm beginning to feel faint. You're just drunk. But I don't drink, Lloyd. There's no one around, anywhere. Well, I'm here. I feel so tired, Lloyd, like the life is running out of me. Well, you're dead, Floyd. In fact, so am I. And now that you mention it, I'm feeling kind of tired myself. Tired of all this. I feel drawn back to the cold comfort of the grave, dear Lloyd. It's calling me back. You know, I feel it too, Floyd. I'm ready for sleep. The grave calls for everyone, Lloyd. It's time again. Look, it's getting to be light outside. You know, now that I think of it, I've never seen daylight around here. That's weird, but you know, I don't think I have either. Me either. Fuck if we did. What's with you idiots and raves? They'll eat your brains. I'll eat your livers if you don't leave us alone. Go away. Looking for raves. Stupid zombies, don't miss it. Rave bus, take us to rave party now. Thank God. What was that all about? A rave bus? What rave? Where? Who knows? Who cares? As long as those creeps are gone. 
I've never seen a rave bus around here. How fucking weird. I guess they were meant to take it. It was their destiny. Well, I hope they're finally fucking happy. Well, I guess they met their destiny. Shit. I hope they have a rave in hell. Susie, are you awake? I am now. Sorry. What's been going on around here? Where did you go? I thought you left me here. I was only gone a few hours at most. I don't know what's going on. What? No way. All kinds of shit's been going on around here. Those kids were thrashing the place and Sal and I had to kick them out. Fuckers. I knew they were no good. Yeah, they got pissed when the drugs ran out and they were being assholes. Good thing for Sal because they didn't listen to me. He kicked them all out himself. Sal. I think Huxley and all the vapors are gone. We couldn't find them anywhere. There's a big hole down in the bedroom in the vapor room. Sal said he last saw Count Jerkula going in like five days ago. Is he okay? Yeah, he's fine. DP and him are down there trying to cover up the hole. There's some kind of weird vapor in there fucking everything up. Yeah, that's what I kind of thought. A few days ago it got really bad and everything was like a roller coaster ride around here. Things were floating around and Morgana and DJ 8-Ball took off. Freaked out. I think that's why this town is called Vapor Valley. Yeah. Makes sense. Now that I'm clear-headed, I can see how strange everything was that I never noticed when high. Me too. Hopefully those guys can fix it once and for all. I hope so. Well, that's done. That should work a lot better than the fucking tapestry. Yeah, that wasn't too difficult. Those lazy hippies could at least try to do better than that. It couldn't be any lazier than you, Jerkula. Hey man, I keep care of all your plants. What do you do? I pay you. Want me to stop? Well, no. Speaking of those lazy hippies, I wonder where they are. Who knows? Let's go check Huxley's lab. For what? Drugs. Good idea. I wonder how those guys are doing. We should go see. This place is kind of creepy with everyone gone. I kind of like it. Finally get some fucking peace. The vapors seem to be gone. Maybe they finally decided they'd had enough. Of what? Of everything. Of this place? Of the world as a vapor? That must suck for them always having to be high just to exist. Maybe so, but that doesn't sound too bad to me. Let's go find DP and Jerkula. Okay. I miss Jerkula. What's with you and Jerkula? I don't know. He seems like a nice guy. Sure, Susie. Well, fuck. There's no one around. There's no Slank, either. Sal probably licked the bowl clean. Oh well, that shit was dangerous anyway. That guy is lucky he didn't fry his brain on it like all the rest of those people did. You know, that reminds me. I wonder if those ghosts are still around. Why? Were they your friends or something? No. But they might know what happened to everyone. Those ghosts are lame. They don't know anything but getting drunk and causing a scene. Well, I'm gonna find out anyway. Okay, I'll go back up and tell the girls we fixed the hole. Ready? Sure, let's go.
Oh, hi. Did you get it fixed? Yeah, we got it fixed. We looked all over the place for those vapor guys, but we couldn't find them anywhere. The slank is all gone too. Sal told me he licked the bowl clean. Yeah, that's what I figured. Where's Jerkula? He went to go ask the ghosts if they know anything. Those ghosts don't know anything, except to thrash and get drunk. I know. I told Jerkula that, but he still wanted to go. Damn it. What? I wanted to see Jerkula. Why? She thinks he's a nice guy. I just wanted to see if he's okay. He's fine. Same dipshit as always. Well, I don't think so. Well, you don't know him as well as I do. I wish I did. Anyone here? Anyone? I wonder where those guys went. It sure is cold in here. And dark. And silent. Shit! This is a mausoleum. I'm out of here. Well, what now, guys? There's no one here either. I don't know. Everyone is definitely gone. What is there to do now? Well, we can finally have a decent party now. Yeah, as long as those kids didn't steal all my liquor. They probably did. I'm sorry, Jenny. I couldn't stop them. It's okay, Susie. I'm sure you tried. Let's go check the bar. Found some. A bottle of tequila. So I saw this UFO, I swear. It had these blinking lights and shit. I swear I even saw an alien inside of it. Wow, Jerkula, that's cool. I saw a UFO once too. Luckily I wasn't abducted and probed. Too bad they didn't probe Jerkula. They could have figured out why he's so confused about shit like UFOs and ghosts. I saw a ghost too. We all did. I wish we didn't. Next time I see one, I'm calling ghost bouncers or something. Those ghosts weren't so bad. They just like to party. You weren't around to see them at their worst. They would get wasted and start breaking things, claiming they were poltergeists. But they were just drunken fools. Speaking of breaking things, I noticed the jungle kids disappeared after we plugged up that vapor hole. Matter of fact, lots of things disappeared and changed. I wonder if that was the cause of it all. Even that sock is gone. He used to wander around all the time, getting in the way. Yeah, I used to see him at the rave yard with the ghosts. But no one was there last time I checked. Actually, the place looks spooky and broken down. Like their life had gone out of it or something. I wonder if the vapor affected that place too. I bet it did. I bet everything will slowly go back to normal around here. Whatever normal is, for a place like this. Hey, that gives me an idea. What? I gotta go check on my place. Can I go? Sure, let's all go. I knew it. What? My fucking house is level now. Wow, that's a trip, man. What? I don't get it. My house used to be crooked, but the inside was level. It was the weirdest thing. It looks normal to me. Well, that's what's weird about it. Let's go inside. Nothing's changed in here. It's like the crookedness was some kind of an illusion. I bet the vapor got all the way out to here. For some reason, it made my place look like it was sinking into the ground on one side. Why would it do that? There must be some reason. Wow, it sure smells good in here. Come on, Susie, I'll show you the garden. Garden? Cool. I love vegetables. You gotta love Count Jerkula, then. I hope they behave themselves in there. Yeah. Jerkula is a real ladies man. They'll be okay. Woo. <laughs>
Dracula. How'd you like the plant, Susie? What plants? Hey, Dracula. You should show Susie your drum set. Hey, good idea. Come on, Susie. I'll show you what I can do. I thought you just showed me what you could do. No, I mean on the drums. Well, I know you got good rhythm, Dracula. Hey, DP. Why don't you show me your plants? Hey, let me get my guitar. Well, why don't you guys just bring that stuff back to my place? Yeah, good idea. There, I think it's all set up now. That's cool, Dracula. I'm glad I play guitar. You know, I think I have a bass around here somewhere that Sal left one time. Did he play bass? No, I don't think so. It used to belong to Sid Vicious or so that's what he told me. He traded to me for some slank one time. I have it around here somewhere. Sid Vicious? Cool! I wish I still had my keyboard, but I traded it one time. For a bus ticket? Yeah. How'd you know? I have one of those too, Susie. Come with me and we'll go get them. Okay. Wow, Sid Vicious. Don't blow it, Jerkula. Things are going pretty well for us. Who gives a damn about Sid Vicious? Susie and you make a good pair, and I think I really like Jenny. Yeah, I really like Susie too. Yeah, so let's not mess this up. Try to be cool and not such a spaz. I think we might be able to restart a new band with these girls if we keep our shit together. Yeah, that would be awesome. I'll be cool, DP. You better. I'll have to kick your ass. Got him. Right on. What should we play? Synthesizer Girl? Be cool, DP. That song blows. Well, what do you suggest, Dracula? Something by Zilch. How about we just jam and see what happens? Yeah, I need the practice. Hey, that's pretty good. Yeah, not bad. Hey, you're pretty good, Susie. You're not so bad yourself, Dracula. Hey, I got an idea. Let's go set up on the big stage and put on a free show for nobody. There's no one left anyway. Well, yeah. We'll do it as a tribute to all our old friends then. Good idea. Let's go. Anyone want to help me with these drums? Always raging down in Vapor Valley, and no one's ever aging down in Vapor Valley. There are ghosts and there are seers, and always the war of beers. The party's always on in Vapor Valley. There's a rockin' house, the lights are flashing. The people there live in there with such a passion. The people there are living there with such a passion. They're not who they appear to be. So look beyond the things you see. Vapor Valley, that's the place. 
No better place to rave in outer space. Vapor Valley, that's the place. No better place to rave in outer space. The portal, vapors live in there. A reality they just can't bear. Once alive, now living in between. Dimensions no one's ever seen. But the party lingers on. With the gravestones all out on the lawn. Deeper Valley, that's the place. No better place to rave in outer space. Zombies searching for a rave. Ghosts that hang out from a grave. And the vapors, who will save them? Who will save them? A sock that searches for its mate. A town that has a ghostly fate And the mushrooms, someone ate them And the mushrooms, someone ate them <laughs>